Shout it, shout it, Paul, shout at your guitar. It's not gonna have a party. If you see this right here, it's because I've I've stopped the image in mid uh, mid thing here. But you but you can clearly see the arm. That's not a Yeti. That's not a Bigfoot. That's not a Herculean arm. I don't know why it looks that way, but uh, that is Paul Stanley, and he's just thrown his guitar to the ground. Uh, 2022 in the May area, and Paul is having a, an issue with his guitar. Now, this is the shout it out loud. Now, yes, um, there has been a bit of talk about discrepancy, vocal discrepancy, and possible lip sync. I'm not here to, to do that. Um, you will have to look at this video very closely and see if you see any lip synkies, but I think I've already done enough Paul Stanley lip synkies. I just wanted to get to the bottom of this. What is going on here? What has happened with the with the, with his guitar? Because he's he's having a little he's having a little he's upset right now. Let's see him do it. Shout it out loud. You don't mind hearing that song, do you? We gotta have a party. If you've watched my uh, my favorite moments of Kiss twenty twenty Kiss twenty twenty goodbye that concert, I did uh, a full one hour video autopsy. This looks a lot like what I remember them doing. Paul Stanley does this weird thing where he he taps Gene Simmons on the shoulder and they goes, "Look over there," uh, and so it, this looks like it's you know, I mean, along with everything else, they have to stage the dance moves and stuff. So let's here we go. Oh! Is that Ric Flair? Woo! Let's see. Yeah, that was. Woo! Yeah, it was Ric Flair. Okay, hold on. Do ya? Look at the lips. Do ya? Do ya? Saying. Nah, dead. Jesus. Looks like a big nacho chip right there. What the hell are you doing, Paul? Is he squatting for a duder? Oh. I mean, I'll be honest with you, I can't do that right now if you gave me a guitar and said do it. But and he's 70. Does the guitar stay in tune after it rubs the belt, rubs the boot like that? Let's see him. Hold on. There we go. I, I, I refuse to believe that you can play a chord when you're holding the guitar like that. Are you playing a chord or is it just strumming an open string? Much easier to pull it out than put it in. A lot of people say that in every avenues and aspects of life. It's much easier to pull it out than put it in. Shout it. All right, now, yeah, I'm, now I'm convinced it is Ric Flair. That is a muscular fellow. But you can see how he scrunched the shoulders. It's like, eh, eh. He's, something's about to blow. Now he's going, what the freak is going on with Ralph and Martin over there, you sons of bitches? Oh, sit there broken hearted. Those lips moved away from that microphone. Broken. He wasn't saying broken when it said broken. I'm just saying. Could you don't say the hearted? See, the, another thing that people say about the lip syncing and stuff is that uh, 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 the, the the mic is not live. It doesn't have to be live. They can have a voice going through the speakers. He could still have the live microphone for when he chooses to sing along, or if he wants to say, "Come on, people." Yeah, this is it. He's had enough. So I don't know if he's not hearing it in his in-ear monitor or 
or be, it would have to be that, right? Because they don't have any monitors anywhere where he would, something's wrong with his guitar. Get. And just throws it right down to the ground. You get out here, you 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 lesser than. Sorry about that, Paul. I mean, you don't throw that guitar down like that. You know, it's. I mean, he can throw it down as hard as he wants because he's uh, he's wealthy. But yeah, uh... yeah, hey, 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 no. You see what I'm saying? Is is uh, it's still a live microphone, um, and there's no actual Paul Stanley vocals going into it right now, so he can go wow, uh, because th technically the vocal, his vocal would not be coming out of that microphone at all. It could be a live microphone that he can say, "Come on, people, here's one," but uh, uh, you know because the the vocals pumping through the PA. Go Tommy! Go Tommy! Go Tommy! He doesn't look so much like a nacho chip from the front, just the back. And this is the perfect example of what I'm talking about because he needs to have the microphone to go, Turn it up louder! And Gene can go, Come on everybody shout it now! Sing! All right, now this, you know what's going to happen here. This is the turn it up louder. That wasn't too bad. I got everybody sounding now. Oh, is he trying to pull an ace? Come on, everybody! Put it, uh, put it through your legs again, there, Paul. And there's little Drew Barrymore back there. Come on, everybody shout it now. Yeah. Eh. We'll leave it right there. Eh. What say you? Now, again, we are not looking into lip syncing. That is besides the point. What happened with the guitar? What are your theories, your thoughts, and opinions on what happened with the guitar? Not what happens with his lips, because we've done enough of that already. We know that he lip syncs for the most part. So get down there and tell me what may or may have not have happened with that guitar. And I want you to shout it out loud to yourself. And I want you to shout it out loud from the rooftops that you are cool, okay? Mm. Shout it, shout it, shout it out loud. Seven apple juice, hey!